Dividend ETF Investing Review. Today, we are looking at QYLD, the Global X by Mirai Asset Covered Call, NASDAQ Covered Call ETF. Today is March 17th, 2024. Let's begin. Our overview with this ETF, Q Yield, high income potential. Q Yield seeks to generate income through the covered call writing, which is historically produces higher yields in periods of volatility. It seeks monthly distributions. Q Yield has made monthly distributions 10 years running. Efficient options execution, Q Yield writes covered calls on the NASDAQ 100 index, saving investors time and potential expense of doing so on an individual basis. Some key facts, the fund has been around since December 11th of 2013, currently has about $8 billion under management. Morningstar categorizes large market cap with an overall three star out of five rating. It currently has 103 holdings. Its asset allocation is 99.82% in equities. It does have derivative income, meaning it uses options for additional income and it is actively managed. It is not a leveraged ETF and it is not an inverse ETF. Um, some key statistics, it has a 0.61% expense ratio with a PDE ratio of 26.97. Uh, it distributes dividends on a monthly basis and its last dividend payout was about 17 cents. Uh, it currently has a share price of $17.83 per, uh, per share with a 38.93 portfolio turnover rate. The trailing 12-month distribution yield is at 11.55%. It has a 30-day distribution yield of 0.27% with a year-to-date total return of 2.76% and a one-year return of 22.75%. And of course, a inception lifetime return of about 7.24%. Uh, the management team has a combined 17 years of experience. Uh, it has four managers currently um, on the team. The top 10 holdings, this ETF tracks a index, the NASDAQ 100 buy right V2 index, um, just for the record, and the holdings in here, so there's a combination. There's a the holdings in here of Microsoft at 9.01%, Apple at 7.78%, NVIDIA at 6.56%, Amazon at 5.33%, Facebook Meta Platforms at 5.11%, Broadcom Avago at 4.43%, Costco Wholesale Corp 2.45%, Google Alphabet Class A shares 2.42%, Tesla Inc. 2.3%, and Advanced Micro Devices AMD 2.37%. The sector breakdown is information technology heavily weighted 50.72%, communication services at 15.60%, consumer discretionary 13.62%, consumer staples 6.55%, healthcare 62 industrials 4.82%, utilities 1.2%, Fractional financials at 0.48%, fractional energy 046 and fractional real estate at 0.26%. This ETF has almost its entire geographic exposure at roughly 100% in the United States, so there is no foreign risk in this one. Uh, and disclaimer, I am not a financial advisor. Please don't take any of this information as financial advice. This information is purely for entertainment and educational value only. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, and we will see you in the next dividend review video.